Canada, we have summer and winter cropping. So we tend to grow cereals, canola, chickpeas, faba beans in winter. And then in summer we have corn, cotton, sorghum and mung beans. 2,4-D we use in crop, in some crops at a later stage. The majority of the 2,4-D we use is in fallow situations. It's good on harder to kill weeds in a mix with other chemistries. In this environment, having cotton as a summer crop, it's always been one that Traditionally, we haven't used over summer. We wouldn't stock it, we wouldn't have it in our sheds. And we certainly wouldn't tell growers to use it over summer when there's cotton in the area. So it's been challenging to either use it early on in the piece or use something else. I first found out about Colex D at the Breezer site and they had heaps of demonstrations there over numerous cropping times. And it was really great to see how much less drift that you had off the Colex D. They had it next to cotton, which was really important to us because we wanted to see how that was working in a real life situation. It made us confident in the product. We used Colex D following harvest. So we had a really, really wet spring and we had a lot of crops that had had nasty weeds like flea bane start to come through the crop late on in the season. So when the crop was harvested, that's when we went in with Colex D and some residual herbicides. The Colex D worked just like 2,4-D should. The way that the Colex D is structured, it's not going to volatilise because of its chemical composition. We're not using it in high risk situations. We're using it away from cotton. We're making sure that the wind's blowing in the right direction. We're using heaps of water. We're using SOA. We're using the right nozzles. Work just like 2,4-D should and yeah, happy.